they all thought I was joking at first. For all the dinosaurs, lions, and mice in Felix Kishinevsky's one-year-old son's room, there's one animal that's no longer just a fairy tale. And I just look, and he had walked out from right behind uh, this chair. Kishinevsky was feeding his one-year-old son at about 6 a.m. when this porcupine was wondering if it was going to get some food, too. And kind of stopped just right in the middle of the room, a couple feet in front of me, sat up and looked at us, and... Uh, yeah, and I said, good morning. What else do you say to a porcupine? Walked out, closed the door, and <laughs> we called the sheriffs. It's not the first time the family has seen this porcupine, only every other time before, it was outside in their backyard. Just hangs out here, eats those pine trees. But the family left a door slightly open last night, and the porcupine decided to do a little exploring and seemed to like being inside, especially under their one-year-old son's crib. I was just trying to kind of get him to move with some trail of dog food, but he wasn't having it. These are pictures of how Summit County deputies eventually caught him with a plastic container and a piece of plywood, relocating it nearby. The family knows it could come back. Maybe hoping to show a story about a lamb is nothing compared to the big adventure of a porcupine. He's welcome to our trees and enjoy everything outside, but late nights, stand outside, bud.